Hello friends, this is King Mo the Ash Man. Today we're gonna be trying Oliva Sears G. Oliva Sears G. This is a boxed press shape cigar. Box press shape, look like a box, you see? It's a square. This is the Churchill Oliva Sears G Churchill. Is seven by fifty box press cigars. Uh, it got a nice aroma to it. Smell very nice. Smell like a little bit fruity. I don't know. It have a nice feel. The texture, the texture is awesome. Very smooth feeling to it. Well made wrapper. I mean, as smoothless, flawless. You know, well, well made handmade cigar uh this is the oliva g series churchill style it's seven by fifty uh we're gonna attempt to try this one today after the disaster earlier from the other disappointed cigar i'm not gonna want to think about it and talk about it right now this is have a nice aroma to it this is a cameroon wrapper with Nicaraguan filler and Habano binder. This is a Cameroon wrapper. The wrapper is a little bit on the darker side. It's not too dark. It's just on the darker side. Cameroon wrapper with Nicaraguan filler, Habano binder. This cigar is not too expensive. Uh, it costs between five and seven dollar a stick. I got this one, so we're gonna go ahead. This is a 91, per, 91 plus rating. The cigar 91, this is on the topper rating cigars. I'm gonna go ahead and cut it with my straight cutter. Uh, perfect cut, perfect everything. This cigar got a nice, lovely aroma to it. So we're going to go ahead, light it up, see how it feel, and give it a try, and get back to you guys, you know. It got up. I don't know, it got a taste to it. Tastes like... I don't know, tastes delicious, maybe because I'm hungry, I don't know, it tastes like fruit, I just had a banana and some uh, olive, uh, not olive, uh, grape, I give it like a gravy, I don't know, get a taste to it, but who cares, let me go ahead, light it up with my torch, uh, we're gonna go ahead and do the square edges the sliders is giving me hard time but this cigar shouldn't take that much got a this cigar got a so right now, I don't know, I taste something. I'm trying to figure out what is it. The draw, it's fine, it's easy. Now, you know, it's very smooth draw to it. That's what I expected from a 90 plus cigar. Oliva, Oliva Series G, Oliva Series G Churchill, 7 by 50 this is a box press cigar look like a box uh i i don't know i it just feel weird in the hand i'm not used to it maybe this is my third box cigar i ever smoked very very smooth draw to it the aroma is just perfect it's got a fruit, 
fruity aroma to it. It's not flavored. It's just got a fruity taste to it. I love that. Look at the burn. Look at the ash. I mean, it's burning 90% evenly so far. The way how I lit it uh, is the way the square is. It should even up in a minute. Let's find out. Uh, as I told you, guys, the cigar is not expensive. Between 5 and $7 a stick. That's for a good cigar. 90 plus, 91, per, 91 plus rating. That's a hell of a deal. That's as I call it a steal. But uh, we'll see. Uh, as of right now, the cigar is not strong at all. I love it, and it's it feel this cigar feel is a mild, mild to medium body strength. And I this is what I in, I like that. I don't want them to be too strong. Uh, I don't have to work hard on, on it. The cigar is very smooth, well balanced. It feel awkward to me because of the box style, but if I get over that, it ha it's well constructed cigar. I mean, it's very, it's not mushy. It's a little bit hot. You know, about three inches, four inches best the flame, the ashes. It feel a little bit hot, warm, you know, but it's nothing worse, seriously. But look at the ash. It start to even up, guys. I love it. So far, I'm loving this Oliva Series G Churchill 7x50 box press, box press cigar. Even the, the wrapper. Even the Cameroon wrapper, look how perfect it is. It's got a nice shade to it. It's not too dark. It's just right shaded color to it. The Nicaraguan and Habano filler binder and it make it taste and smell awesome. I'm in love. You know something guys, I could be talking more and more about this cigar. I'm very happy after my early, early disaster with that. I don't want to even think about that cigar so far. Other than the early disaster I had earlier today, I said, uh-oh, I'm going to give me a good cigar to just balance that experience I had earlier. Let me stop the video for a minute or two. Let me smoke a little bit more and come back with my final thought. I don't want to keep talking more and more. I try to keep these quick videos under a certain time, but I'm not having any luck. The more I talk... The more I enjoy, the more I talk, and this video is going to be 20, 22, 25 minutes. I try to keep them under 15 minutes if I can, and let's see if I'm going to be successful. All right, this King Mo, the Ash Man again. Uh, ash, thick, perfect ash, even the pern. You know, earlier it wasn't hurt perfectly. Now it's almost per as perfect as it could be in a cigar. Uh, it's a box press shape. Uh, this is the Oliva. I th hopefully I'm saying it right. The Oliva Siri G. The Oliva Siri G Churchill 7x50 box press shape cigar. This is a 91 plus rating this is have a, a Cameroon ribbon with Nicaraguan Habano filler and binder it have it's not a flavor cigar but it have a taste of natural taste like nuts and fruit and this is make it outstanding I mean it got a smooth draw to it awesome awesome ash this cigar is just perfect in any meaning, any way you want to put it. It's a perfect cigar. It's nice, well constructed, even burn. I mean, I could keep, keep talking more and more about it, guys. The, the price on this cigar between five and seven cigar. I love it. I will. I, would I smoke this again? Definitely, I will. 
Is it an everyday cigar? For me, I already have my own everyday cigars. I'm not looking to add more. But that could be if you prefer it. I mean, it's very smooth, medium body, uh, mild medium bodies, flavor, uh, strength. That could be an everyday cigar. If I'm looking for a new something else, I'm definitely will consider it. It'll, I'm gonna keep it in my note <clears throat> for future consideration if I decide to add more. <clears throat> uh, got this one by mail from, I forgot where I got it from. It's one of these uh, cigar places on the internet. Uh, I love it. The ash is well made, perfect, constructed, nice aroma. Got the fruity, earthy taste to it. It's not flavored, but it just got that taste. It mild to medium strength. I'm in love with it, guys. For now, I gotta guys let you go. I wanna enjoy my Oliva. Uh, Series G and uh, Churchill 7x50 box press cigar. This is King Mode Ashman. Till next time.